Oh, hello there, YouTube. <laughs> Welcome to Sunday, the 29th of March. The silence is mind blowing. There's no cars going up and down the highway. But look at this little tiny patches of blue we're getting out here. But it's uh, more of a chance of rain today than what it was yesterday. So, so far, it's, um, it's like right at noon. I've been doing some in-house projects. Kelly took herself a good long nap. She said the dogs woke her up too early. So my banging around, doing my little projects in here, woke her up. <laughs> so kind of a project day today. Look at that, isn't that beautiful? I don't know what that tree is. Probably just a mutt tree. This is those pink honeysuckles. They smell so good. The moss on those wooden planks, that's really cool. But it's very peaceful out here. Some morning doves hooting and hollering over there. At the and the plum trees, Kai Kai's way out there. And yeah, just been very peaceful. I couldn't figure out what I'd done with this coat. And when I went out there to work on the iron last week, I, uh, whatever that was, I uh, set it down out there. It slipped and fell down, so I couldn't find it. <laughs> there used to be a goat house. But Bella and now Kylie's decided to do it. They scratch on it and they're slowly pushing the thing over. God, that was years ago. Hope you guys are having a nice day. At the moment, it's not raining and it feels wonderful. And I love seeing them blue, blue skies. I was in there working away, all of a sudden, woof! Sun came out for a moment and I says, Where's the camera? We gotta start the vlog. <laughs> Yes, that is 6.30. Man, have I created the worst nightmare ever. I mean, Kelly cleaned up some stuff as well, but I've almost filled that dumpster out of what's come out of my office area where, hey, Annie, where I work each night. Holy moly. Man, the piles of junk that was in here. No, they, they see Danny and the heat is on. But anyway, yesterday, you're going to stop that, Annie. Danny ain't even out there. He probably ran by. <laughs> I'm, I got my eyes on you too, Sashi, you crazy mutt. <laughs> Anyway, in, riding in the rain, um, I've done this before, and uh, even somebody even I think somebody sent me a link or sent me something somewhere talking about doing this, trying to well, try to waterproof a GoPro five, six, or seven. The eight is in its own little world. The problem being, right here, there's a door. Hold on a second here. Let's just turn a little light on. How about that? On the side here is this door. It's in the cage. It's in its little holding cage. This is my Hero 5. Um, that rear port back there is a USB-C. That's the uh, where the microphone adapter plugs in. Well, it's not waterproof. So, the reason I brought this up, I thought, I need to talk about that. Because I just found one. I've got one of these that's about half empty. But it's these Max um, silicone silicone putty. It feels like wax, but they're earplugs. I mean, it literally feels like wax, but it's silicone. Um, Jeff turned me on to these things coming back from uh, uh, Yellowstone when him and I were together. and He uh, he rode with me all the way to Coeur d'Alene, Idaho. 
and uh that's where we split up and i went to my mom's house and and he went on to his family anyway you take take these and after you plug your microphone adapter in you can wedge that silicone putty around that hole well the problem is i've seen other people talking about this and they're talking about it like it's waterproof you see the huge gaps between the case and the gopro there's a major problem with doing that it's a splash re resistance thing that would be cool but two things <laughs> this cover there's a big hole there where the uh, record button is and when you flip the uh, flip the lid up there's a big hole right there the water just pours in well it runs along the sides of the case and it just comes right down and pours in there if you ever ridden in the rain with one of these get my lens cap off pop the camera out if you ever ridden in the rain with one of these you'll notice when you pull the cover off it's just pooled in water and on the on the mic adapter side it's cut away see there's no lip on this side there's there's a lip so you have a little bit of a buffer and if you take your fingernail and you dig into that a little bit there's actually a rubber seal that runs more than three-fourths of the way well it does not run where the the lens there's no rubber seal right here and there's no lip on the edge so the water just pours right in and goes right down in it in no way shape or form makes a hero five six or seven waterproof by stuffing wax in there you couldn't stuff enough wax in there to make it waterproof now i'll agree it's a uh, you know a good splash resistant kind of a thing that would that would help but uh yeah not waterproof the water's still just gonna come pouring down pool in and my fear is and when i've done it a couple of times it actually funneled it actually kind of guided the water to these water ports and when i got done i had no audio because as soon as that thing gets wet i think it creates some kind of something the gopro doesn't like and the gopro just turns the mic completely off you don't it doesn't turn the mic adapter off and then you get the built-in mics you get no audio it's just blank there's no cracking there's no static it just turns the mic off but uh that's the one weak point is that door has to be off to plug the mic adapter in because gopro won't release the bluetooth they have wonderful bluetooth but they won't release it to uh microphones i'm sure there's some reason why but i don't know but anyway i thought i'd show you guys that if you want to try that you know for some resistance because there was times yesterday where the wind uh, was blowing so hard sideways and it was blowing towards the microphone port I was thinking man I should put some of that silicone putty in there just to stop the the sideways you know I mean literally the rain's going sideways from hitting that so you guys can do that it does work I mean you you can get something in there and create a little bit of resistance but uh just be mindful it under no circumstances even makes it water resistant the water still pours in there if you're riding with that camera attached to your helmet flying down the road so it's max pillow soft silicone putty earplugs i don't know where the other one is this is one that's never been open i think it's in one of my backpacks somewhere but i couldn't find it but kelly's uh vacuuming in that area and I go into a crazy sneezing fit when she vacuums and I was hot even though I had all the windows open I thought I'd come out and show you guys that I almost lost that because I'm making piles and then slowly putting stuff back <laughs> so my next thing is I'm gonna use that shelf to try to organize um, in that corner where I had this pile but I need to adjust those shelves a little bit so I need to come out here and do that anyway so I told Kelly I'm gonna do my little silicone putty and and try to adjust my shelves a little bit it's time to bring them in and start the reverse i've been doing this all day long isn't that crazy all right 
Good lord. How long did I yak to you guys? Holy moly. Alright. I got some other work to do. This will probably be a two day thing. But um, hopefully I can get a ride in tomorrow. Look at this. As it hasn't rained long enough. It's actually nice out here at the moment. Alrighty. So what I'm going to do here, I have this lower shelf right on the bottom. And I think I'm going to come up just a little bit, space them a little closer together so that I can still shove small things like shoe boxes or something about that height. Shoe box size stuff underneath there. Well, now I don't have a cool little holder for my RC car. <laughs> we'll come up with something else. That's no big deal. Wow, what a workout day. I'll probably be sore tomorrow after all this bank. Oh, I stuck those on there. <laughs> I was like, what in the heck? I thought the thing popped out. Oh, that saw shit at the door. I thought the little woman was coming in. So I'm gonna make a small adjustment here, even them out, and uh, start going back together with this thing. Well, hello there, YouTube. At quarter, quarter to 10. Wow, that's right. It's quarter yeah. to ten. And the crazy thing is, I'm not done. No. I have the office area all all set up for the most part, but I made a disaster of things that still need to be Find organized and, and put away. And then everything's got this little sheen of dust on it that you got to deal with that. So both of us have been sneezing. We got all the windows and stuff and front door and everything all open today for a while that was very nice yeah it only got to like 51 52 yeah but it's every time i start some little project it just sparks one in her <laughs> next thing i know she's going crazy on her little areas that she does her stuff in and i'm telling you we almost filled that dumpster out there yeah I that's don't crazy i know how we do that but it's that's crazy it's amazing it's been a while since we've done a good old-fashioned spring cleaning, you know. Yeah, it definitely needs Oh, it. yeah, you got to do that every year. If you don't, it just stacks up. Yeah. Well, I went a little deeper this time, digging through, because I keep running into situations where I'm looking for something and I can't find it. It's there so, somewhere. Yeah, it ends up like boxes, you know, and you put sorted things in a box, don't label it, and the box gets shoved aside or just shove it in a bag somewhere and different backpacks and that's how i found the the earplug things here as well i still have i got another pack of them like i say it's about half used up no idea where those are i looked in all the backpacks i guess there's one in the oh yeah there's my uh tech pack like it could be in that one there's a couple of backpacks that aren't with you know i didn't think about that i've got my backpacks all organized well stacked at the moment not really yeah. organized <laughs> But um, got them all in one place. But I just remembered I got two, three of them in a walk-in closet. Yeah. Get them all sorted out. And we then she's the got her fetish. own collection of backpacks that's starting here, too. Talking about me and my backpacks. I'm good. I only have three. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Are you counting that Can-Am one? Oh, four. Yeah. So. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That, that new one is still in the bag. Yeah. It? But that one's a little... A little small for my size it's a uh, she's she's maxed out it's it's definitely wearable but it's it's a it's gonna <laughs> it's gonna add its limits and it kind of mounts up that new way of doing stuff with the with that middle strap it's one of those style things oh, they're so comfortable yeah i like that that way it doesn't feel like it's pull, yeah. pulling off of you yeah it feels like it's just attached to you not hanging on your back yeah. You get people, oh, I can't stand a backpack. You just haven't wore the right backpack. Yeah. They're great when it's cold. And then, uh, you know, as long as they're vented, they're okay in the in the summer. But that reverse effect, if you ride behind a shield, you'll appreciate a backpack. Yeah. Because the wind swirls around you and just, God, hits you right in the back. Yeah. Makes you cold. If you don't use a windshield, you don't even know what I'm talking about. This is true. <laughs> Anyway, um, not sure what I have for a vlog today. Talked about trying to waterproof a uh, Hero 5 through 7 that's not quite waterproofable. But I don't know what it is about those cameras. They, I'm not telling you to go dunk it in water, but uh, they'll take a lot of abuse 
a tremendous amount of abuse. All of my, that, good Lord, that Hero 5 has been wet so many times. Yeah, it gets caught out a lot. Yeah, and then the 6, I was using it for a while. But it seemed to be the most sensitive to when it gets damp, shutting the mic off. So if there's any chance of a sprinkle or whatever, I just don't use the Hero 6 black. Mm-hmm. But anyway, I guess I'll get up in the morning, finish up what I got. I'll, I'll have to finish up because the living room was the staging area. Yes. <laughs> She's not too happy about that. Everywhere. She has seen Sasha and Annie when they come in, they're like, Oh yeah. What happened? <laughs> Annie's so skittish, you know. She's like, "What's going on here?" And every time I move something, she goes and runs and and hides somewhere. Annie, no I one know. is ever like she is so attacked skittish. you with anything. She's like a cat. They, you know how cats just they don't like spring and jump. They just have like springs built in. They just go boop and disappear. That's what she does. It's the yeah. funniest thing. She goes and hides on the back of the couch or yeah. the arm of the couch. Yeah. She thinks she's part cat, too. Yeah. It's the craziest thing. I'm telling you, that dog climbed trees. Yep. Well, it's funny. The one thing she's scared of is a sneeze. Oh, yeah. Oh, and my Lord. That oh, will send man. that dog off. Kelly go, choo, boom. She's, she's already gone. gone. Yeah. You don't even Crazy. get that <gasps> out, yep. and she's gone. No, like, boom, no spring, no, like, cocking and then goes she's just boop, like a cat just yeah standing there she's gone craziest oh, dang thing you ever seen crazy dog yeah and you can't fake it you try no. to you know I, like a cat you know she's getting so it's fun to like spook her every once in a while you know and i go ah! doesn't even no, phase her she knows it's not real crazy but she's gone before the sneeze happens when kelly goes ah! boop. <laughs> <laughs> that's so funny Anyway, we're going to roll out on you. All right. That's hope, all you got? Yeah, just hoping the, tomorrow's weather's better. We yeah. Go for a little rip. As it turned out, last part of this day, I could have went. It kept going, it's going to rain. The little weather thing pops up, rain in 15 minutes. And I'm like, well, glad I didn't try to go for a ride. It never rained. No. Now, if he would have got all ready to go, it would have poured. Oh, yeah. Absolutely. Oh, well. All right. Maybe tomorrow. All right. All right. Well, thank you guys so much for watching. We really do appreciate it. We will talk to you tomorrow. Same smoke time, same smoke channel. Don't forget to give her a thumbs up. And you guys have an amazing Monday or Tuesday. Heck yeah. All right. All right. See you tomorrow. You guys take care. All right. Bye-bye now. Thanks mm -hmm. for watching. Bye. Mm -hmm.